Now he can take a huge lead. He breaks for third. The pitch is swung on, hammered to right field, and that ball is gone. Esteban Florio hammers a home run, a three-run shot, and the scranton Wilkesbury Rail Riders now lead the Clippers 3-1. I'm telling you, all of that stuff played into it. It really did. You got the runner back there trying to distract the pitcher, get him off his game. You get the two disengagements. And you throw the start against the Clippers. Pitch is hit in the air to left field. This will be an easy one for Florio, who comes in, gets under it, and he makes the catch. One well, on the scorecard, and I imagine you do as well. <laughs> First pitch swinging to Johnny Rodriguez. He flares it to left field, and it's caught for out number three. You're gonna oh, stick the new look and logo. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. It's hit high in the air and deep to left field. Racing back, Gonzalez onto the warning track. At the wall, it's gone. Esteban Florio with a two-run home run now has three runs scored today and five runs batted in. He has had a hand in every Rail Riders run in this ball game. And he now has a legitimate shot at the Scranton Wilkesbury franchise home run record, which sits at 30. Already down five runs. You want to keep it right there. Here's a ball hit in the air toward left field on the run. Oscar Gonzalez, it'll get down, and it bounces toward the corner. They're going to hold the runner at third base as Oscar quickly gets it back in. But that is a double. It brings home a run. As Defoe came all the way around to score, they held Bastidas at third. And that's another run for the scranton Wilkesbury Rail Riders on the RBI double. And what a day for Esteban Florial. 